Morning guys. I am on my way to the gym. I did 10 miles yesterday and now everything hurts. Everything hurts. Uh, but I'm on my way to the gym again. Hashtag active recovery. The race was great. Yesterday was a struggle. In more ways than one. Okay, so if you saw my Instagram, yesterday you saw me all talking about, oh, it was the Papa John's 10 miler. And so at the end they were serving Papa John's pizza and I didn't have any pizza, yay me. Only to go home and binge later that night. Like, it was bad. I, just, I mean, I had pizza, ice cream, cupcakes, tortilla chips. I mean, part of me was really bummed because I was like, dang it, Autumn, you really didn't need to do that. But honestly, the other part of me was not bummed because it was actually really satisfying. Like, it made me feel good. And the last cheat day that I had really was not satisfying. I was eating these things because it was a cheat day and I was not happy. And the only thing worse than binge eating and feeling satisfied with all the food you ate is binge eating and not feeling satisfied with all the food you ate. Like, because then it's really for nothing. At least yesterday I got some enjoyment and a sense of satisfaction that I have not had in a very long time with that sort of food. So. I want to say I feel I worked it out of my system, but still, you know, those got to be few and far betweens. Uh, but I mean, so is running 10 miles. So, you know, let's just keep it in the past. Today is a new day. Got my pre-workout. I am not meal prepping. Well, I'm not going shopping today because I am going out of town for work on Wednesday. So it won't be a full meal prep. It'll only be Monday, Tuesday. And I already have enough food for two days to do meal prep. So no Meyer today, but off to the gym. decided to turn today into a full day of eating as well because honestly I'm just really looking for some accountability I guess I just want to pay attention to what I'm eating and a great way to do that is to have to put it on camera so you saw me just make that coffee drink it's really just like equal parts cold brew and almond milk and then some of that sugar-free syrup it's a nice little weekend treat and then I also got an Atkins bar, just a nice little on the go breakfast. I also have five pieces of Sunday bacon waiting for me when I get back home. Uh, as you can see, I'm not at home. I'm actually going to go to the outlet mall with my aunt, yay, 
Today is beautiful, great day for shopping. Would have been a great day for running 10 miles, but we had to do that in the damn ice yesterday. So go figure. You see for meal prep, all I did was just do two omelets. I am going to make them into pizza omelets this week and that is very exciting. So basically just made an omelet, gonna fill it with marinara sauce, mozzarella and Parmesan cheese and pepperonis and call it a day, hello. We're in the Michael Kors store and those are my aunts behind me. Like we've been here for what feels like hours and they're deliberating over the same two persons. I shouldn't have come here. Is it only 11.57? It feels like we've been here forever. You guys, uh, icing is like one of my favorite things ever. And we're in the Great American Cookie Company store right now and it's just like sugar and icing overload and I'm just like, good thing I'm back on track today. do that again that was horrible so here's my lunch for today who says omelets are just for meal prep so I made a cheese omelet with the Trader Joe's uh, bagel seasoning and then there are three pieces of Sunday bacon right there spoiler alert I've already eaten two but it's just bacon so I didn't feel bad about not filming that I'm filming the rest of it so there you have it okay so now I'm gonna sit down and have some food and Maybe I'll clean up after that. I have some errands to run, so I'll be going to the shop today, but I'm just relaxing for right now. Okay, so I wanted to finish up my breakfast slash lunch with something sweet and salty. So I made my keto trail mix, which was sunflower seeds, macadamia nuts, and Lily's chocolate chips. Has about six or seven carbs. I'm about at, let's see, six plus five from the bar, plus one from the food. I'm about at 12 so far, 12 carbs so far today. So we'll see what that looks like later. Well, in true business owner fashion, I stopped by the shop today to do some work and stayed way longer than I intended. And it's too late to eat anything else. Well, a real meal. So I am going to have some cheese sticks and the uh, sugar-free Jello and call it a night. Even though my meals were kind of random and all over the place, it was really good to get back on the keto track and get back to normal. Thanks for watching this video. If you like it, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, watch Autumn Keto. Also comment below, give this video a thumbs up and you can find me on Instagram at watchautumnketo. Thanks and I'll catch you next week.